Ladies and gentlemen, before we actually do my proper introduction, let's do some settings, shall we? Yes, the language is fine and the screen is fine. Brightness, let's look at it. Now we don't have a HDR that's locked. Gonna increase the brightness by two. Yes, by two. I can at least increase it by one or two most times. Um, I'm gonna look at the subtitles because, yeah, I always play with subtitles on when I play these kind of games. Um, the size, I'm guessing the size is the font of the writing of the dialogue and we're going to keep that as medium yeah it is so we're going to keep that as medium background enables a dark background background behind the subtitles now we don't need that and we could change the color of the writing that's pretty impressive to white yellow blue green or red for now it's going to be blue and um if it's too light for the um, background and it you can't see the subtitles i'll probably change the red the name colors yeah we'll put the name colors on and um, direction, I guess we'll keep off. But yeah, the background, um, we'll just show you. The background is that line thing. We don't need that. There's going to be times where we don't see it at all anyway, because uh, most of this game likely will take place in daytime. I don't know. All right, so audio. Yeah, all of that's fine. We don't need to change it. Accessibility. We don't need to change that whatsoever. So let's continue. Sony Interactive Entertainment presents. Oh man, I'm so excited to play this game. You don't understand. A Naughty Dog Productions. Oh yes. <laughs> Welcome to Let's Play The Last of Us Part 2. Made in 2020 by Naughty Dog, released on the PlayStation 4. It's finally here, guys. I complete The Last of Us with the time that I had left and it all conveniently ended yesterday so today we are going to do the last of us and um yeah we're just going to check the controllers quickly remember shoulder swap nah um photo mode that's always off even though um somehow in game in the previous game I turned it on but yeah everything's going to remain the same extras is just concept art and stuff yeah that's okay we're not going to do anything let's access the story options let's see what it's going to give us shall we obviously new game because we haven't played it this is the first of two episodes of the day as promised i'm going to upload two episodes each day until i beat the game so you have very light which is very easy Light which, is, um, light, which is easy, moderate, medium, hard, obviously hard. The survivor is the super hard difficulty. So, very light. Explore and experience the story with lighter combat challenge. Camera and aim assistance are enabled by default. Less challenging than moderate. Resources are common and enemies are less dangerous. That's light. Moderate. Provides a balanced experience. Resources are limited. Then you have hard modes, obviously. For those looking for a greater challenge, resources are very limited and enemies are more dangerous. I love the sound of that. Survivor, an intense, demanding challenge. Resources are extremely scarce. Enemies are deadly. No, but we're going to go hard mode. Pre-order bonus. Um, Well, we pre-ordered the game. So, um, yeah, the bonus is going to stay on. It just gives Ellie um, ammo capacity for her pistol and um, the crafting training manual. That's fine. We'll keep those on. And we'll keep the aiming introvert and look introvert off. So yeah, without further ado, I think it's time to enter the world of The Last of Us once again. New game, you have selected hard challenge level. Challenge um, can be changed in time with the options plus difficulty. We are not changing the options difficulty whatsoever, so let's enter the world of The Last of Us. Enjoy the game. I'm going to stay quiet for the most of the cutscenes. Well, all of the cutscenes, should I say. But um, loading screens and whatnot, I will talk. But for now, I'm going to stay quiet. Enjoy the opening cutscene of The Last of Us 2. I'll see you when the cutscene ends. Oh, it's got a long ass loading screen there. So I can talk a bit longer. But this game is anticipated, but I will make sure you guys um, enjoy the cutscenes without me commentating over it or anything like that. Or dialogue, I won't do that either. I will um, talk after it. So yeah, that's all I'm going to say about that. But for now, enjoy the world of The Last of Us as the loading screen has officially finished. In two seconds.
supposed to take it to the fireflies and walk away. You go halfway across the country. She needed her immunity to mean something. Maybe I was starting to buy into that old cure business. Maybe I just wanted to do right in life. I knew it made it. You found the fire. This is our future. Think of all the lives we'll save. Jesus Christ, Joe. What do we do? a lot. Where's Ellie now? I told her they just ran some tests. I told her her immunity didn't know. And she believed you? Head back. Okay, so um, that was interesting, Joel retelling Tommy about um, what happened in the last game. Yes, I do defend Joel for what he did, because it was either they created the cure and let Ellie die, or Joel just takes matters into his own hands, which he did, because no matter what, Ellie would have died if she offered herself to the cure. And I don't think Joel would have lived with himself um, if that happened. But... Um, yeah, I'm glad Joel's in the game, because a lot of people made theories when the first game came out that, um, when the first trailer, sorry, came out that Joel is dead. Right, so here we're going to hold um, L1. But I'm glad um, we came back to Tommy, so um, at least Tommy's got more screen time. So, um, so far so good with the cutscenes, and um, I'm glad they retold the story. And um, he made Tommy hear it because I, 
I thought he was going to keep that to himself. But he didn't. I really do love the backgrounds of this game. Especially when you're um, horse riding. You can see a lot of backgrounds of this thing. It's just amazing already. I just love how this game visually looks. As it's introducing all the people that um, were behind this game. Hmm. But yeah, I know Neil Drunkman was um, responsible for everything in terms of the script. I think that's his name anyway, Neil Drunkman. But um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to this game. I bet you they improved their quarantine zone by um, make, um, getting to a bigger facility. Oh, wow. They did. That is awesome. Here we are. As Tommy would say, I want to know what this place looks like. This place looks amazing. Sorry I stayed a bit quiet because I thought there was going to be some dialogue. Laura Bailey is everywhere. It's okay. I got him. You go on. You sure? Yeah. About what we were talking about earlier. Can't say I've done different. Take to the grave by a few. I'll see you later. See you, Tommy. Give me a heart attack. I tried not to eat it. Hey. Hey. What's up, Joel? Just checking in. Folks we I think talking about how impressed they are with you and how well you're Helping out. It's good. Yeah. Tommy and I went out riding the other day, and he, uh, <laughs> he told me a joke. So I thought about you. And, uh, oh shoot, now I forgot it. Uh, something about a clock. How do you? Joel, it's uh, it's pretty late, and I gotta. Get up in a few hours. Yeah, 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 I know. I'm gonna get out of your hair. Just, um. I, w I wanna show you something. Just give me one second. What's this? Some folks call this thing here a detox. Okay. Okay. I'm 
promise me that you won't laugh. You laugh. Oh, we get to play the guitar. Nice. Do you know what um, who Joel reminds me of? And probably you are going to agree with me. He reminds me a lot of um, Logan slash Wolverine. You know, just has that dad vibe, you know, like in the Logan movie. But yeah, he reminds me a lot of um, Wolverine. You know, the way he's like a father figure to Ellie. Say tomorrow night, first lesson. Yeah. Okay. Did Do you remember the joke? What is the downside to eating the clock? It's time consuming. It's so dumb. <laughs> it's so dumb. The Last of Us Part 2 Had to Oh, 
just trying to make you jealous. I didn't... I would never... <sighs> I'm messing with you, man. I don't care. Get dressed. <sighs> You're the worst. <laughs> it's kind of fucked up you did that. Time to get dressed, and Ellie is officially a young adult now, so that's amazing. And, um, no, let's get our guns ready and whatnot. And I'm going to change the text. Yeah, I'm probably going to change the colour of the text in the next video, um, because you couldn't see it, because it was um, blending with the snow. And that's my fault for picking blue. What were the odds of me um, knowing? Nice reflection. At least they got the reflection looks perfect. But yeah, what were the odds of me um, picking my favorite color and it would blend in with the background? Chances were very high. All right, let's grab this. I got this right. You kiss Dina. She kissed me. Which triggered Seth to call you a not so nice word. Yeah. Then Joel decked him. I have a crush. And then you got mad at Joel. That part confused me. It was a strange night, man. Sounds exciting. Maria wants a word with you. Where is she? The diner. Is this about Seth? No clue. Tell her you never saw me. Nope. Where's your fucking loyalty? Excuse me? All right, let's go. Hey, so... We're okay, right? You and me? Yeah, of course. Dina and I are done. I know. I was just... I don't want you to think... Ellie. If you say so, I guess we're cool. I hope they are. Be awkward. He's fully grown. Bless that dog. Right, so it looks like we're heading into a bar. Judging by the looks of things. Because we're going to meet Maria, who is Tommy's wife. If you remember in the previous game. Oh, after me. He's always going to do that. No. Where's Maria? In the back. Coming through. night I was uh, I was drinking too much sure I'm trying to say I'm sorry Maria tells me that you and Dean are headed out I made you some sandwiches okay Your steak thank you Seth What you got there? Bacon sandwiches. Mm. Smells good. They're yours. You sure? 
It's fine. Let me watch you out. Okay. So clearly Ellie doesn't like Seth. I mean, he does um, come off. He does come off as like um, a drunkard. Check out the creek trail. I'll need someone else to cover it. Ellie, you know the creek trails? Not really. Dina's done it a bunch. I'll have the two of them take it. Yeah, that's not that. All right. Can I talk to you for a sec? Fine. We can talk. Your girlfriend is stable space. Oh. Hey, Dina. Can I talk to you? <laughs> hey, guys, I'm tapping out. Come on, how long? Whew. Hey, thanks. Um, I just want to say sorry for running off last night. Oh, that's it's okay. I totally get it. I I just I felt bad. Why? I cuz I started the whole thing and I just I shouldn't have kissed you in front of all of those people and yeah, you were drunk, that's fine. Well, still, I just I don't want you to think No, I'm not reading into it or anything. You know what I love about you? That you let me finish my sentence. We should probably get going. Ow! What the fuck? I'm not even playing! Because you're a chicken? You're a chicken! <laughs> I hate this guy so much. You wanna fuck him up? Yeah, I do. You asked for it! You better run, you little shit! Oh, you piece of shit! Get to cover! Go! Go! So now our first bit of action is actually playing a um, snowball fight. So the first to ten wins. And well, that was a terrible throw by me. Ow. Ow. Okay, that was terrible. Alright. Yeah, you run, you punk. Come here. I'm not done with you. Yeah, keep running. Ugh. <laughs> Taking the lead. Well, let's throw another snowball at you. Ah, you missed. Throw. Oops, that was the worst throw I've ever done. Right, throw another one. Oh, we're definitely going to beat these kids. Oh, that was a horrible throw by you. You were behind me this entire time and you couldn't even hit me. Ha, gotcha. Two more points left. Gotcha again. Oh, that throw was horrible. Right, let's chase you. Come here. Right, let's throw it at you. us to do the creek trail he's gonna relieve joel and tommy oh that's nice you assigned us together you're gonna like this group i hope joel's okay you know i do want to play as him in this game well i hope i do anyway